How to use helping verb is. In a sentence, when a noun is singular, helping verb is goes with it. For example, Arham is a good boy. Rose is beautiful. Pakistan is a great country. In a sentence, when subject is singular, helping verb is goes with it. For example, my mother is making a cake. Here, my mother is the subject of the sentence and it is singular. So, we use is as an helping verb. The bag is full of books. Here, the subject is also singular. So, we use is as an helping verb. The road to the village is steep. Here the subject is singular, a road to the village. So what we learned here is the subject verb agreement that when the subject of a sentence is singular, we use is as a verb to complete the sentence. We also use is when in the subject of the sentence we have a pronoun he, she or it is goes with it. For example, he is a teacher. She is reading a book. It is raining. Here, the subject of the sentence is he. Therefore, we have used is. How to use helping verb are. In a sentence, when noun is plural, are is used as a helping verb. For example, the elephants are hungry. Roses are beautiful. Aisha and Adil are laughing. Here, the uh, in this in these sentences the nouns are plural elephants roses aisha and adil two children in a sentence when subject is plural are is used as a helping verb for example the birds and the bees are busy in the garden here the subject the birds and the bees are Plural, therefore, we are using are to complete the sentence. The boys are playing football. Here also the subject is plural, so we are using are. So, subject verb agreement, when the subject is plural, we use are as an helping verb. When two singular nouns or pronouns in the subject are joined by and, we use are to complete the sentence. For example, Ali and Ahmed are best friends. Sara and I are making a cake. A pencil and a plate are on the table. Here, this is also very important. Again, when two singular nouns or pronouns in the subject are joined by and, we use are. We use are when the subject is a pronoun, you, we, they. We are eating mangoes, they are tired, you are a good student. Here the subject of the sentence uh, are the pronouns we, they and you. Therefore, we are using are. Let's do an exercise. Use is a, or are to complete the sentence. My chair is broken. Her clothes are new. The, the dogs are barking. Umar and Asad are absent today. The flowers are lovely. This book is very interesting. She is a brave girl. Hope you have understood the concept of using the helping verb is and are and how we use it. The most important part of it is that when we have two singular nouns and they are combined with and, we use are. Thank you.